Hey everybody, my name is Ivica. Thank you so much for joining me on my latest Let's Play guide or beginner guide video that will showcase naval action, a really cool sailing, age of sailing game that I started exploring and playing, especially thanks to a really cool, really effective and really, really awesome guide from Naval Gaming. To get the same guide, to check it out as I did, please check out the link in the description below. It's a perfect hub for anyone who is into or wants to get into this title and wants to try it out. Basically, Naval Action, it's a free to play game, you can get it on Steam for free. And Naval Gaming and their quick guide is the perfect location to get the info you need and the info that will help you out. Now, I'm going to showcase the start of the game and the basic intro experience that anyone who gets the game for the first time will go through and I'm going to select server and I'm going to create my profile basically so as you can see you can enter the name I'm going to go with a really really creative first and last name <laughs> and you have the selection of nations as you can see you have pirates Spain France Great Britain I'm going to keep pirates and I'm going to create the same profile. So let's start the game. Age of Sail, always an interesting and fascinating period of human history. It's the moment when basically European nations managed to circumnavigate the globe first and foremost and then build ever better ships using the power of nothing more than the wind that is also known as the age of exploration and additional names are known <laughs> for the same period of time as well but in the nations that kind of bore the brunt of that exploration it wasn't only exploration it was also a time of exploitation and great suffering but we won't go into that so as you can see here is my basic brig the graphics of the game are really cool and they look really appealing. We have in the background noises of the sea, noises that kind of showcase the same natural environment. Also the camera movement, I'm right now rotating around the ship, I can also zoom in, are also really effective. As you can see, my basic brig is not armed or anything quite spectacular but that is the starting point of the game I have my options here of equipment repair which is presently not needed crew management and hold or cargo I have a lot more options as well here this is basically the home port as you can see behind me which allows you to check the tavern navy warehouse, shop, auctions, admiralty, crafting and building, port quests and outposts. Last is the investment. Here is the basic guide for the game as you can see from the in-game perspective but again I would suggest checking out naval gaming and the link in the description below which will take you directly to the pretty awesome selection of amazing tutorials from a range of authors all of which are designed to help anyone who is into naval action and become the same page can and will become your go-to hub for a quick start guide again check out the same website in the description below now here are the basic tips for the start. As you can see, it's kind of a drop down menu. It's a really, really kind of condensed set of information, which is kind of the point as well. But the idea is to kind of be able to get into things like even PvP or player combat. Now, of course, I don't believe I'm going to <laughs> reach that point whatsoever in the game however I will try to get 
to sail the ship because I watched one of the tutorials on naval gaming related to sailing. It's really detailed, it's really precise and physics based. Sailing is kind of a tough thing to do because it's counterintuitive. People usually believe that winds are blowing right behind the sailboat and filling up the sails. Actually, that happens pretty rarely. Most of the time you get kind of wind that blows to the sides of the craft where you have to use the same kind of side momentum to sail zigzag. And it's a complex process, but Navy, naval action is a game that kind of tries to do a lot with the basic, physic basic physics and keep it set on the same physics level of realism. The dawn has came, as you can see, it's daylight. And now let's see if I can leave port and sail around a bit. So I'm presently entering open world. Maybe someone <laughs> attacks me immediately. I'm not sure how the PvP works for beginners, but again, Naval Gaming Guide offers you the same insight, which is again, very, very, very cool. And right now I'm guessing I'm entering the matchmaking lobby, which would be an element that si similar games have, but in this game, in the case of this game, it's not actually a lobby or anything like that. But hopefully the experience will be interesting even though really, really basic <laughs> in my case, I just want to get my brig going, get my brig going basically anywhere. But to have that happen, the game has to load and we are going to wait a bit for the same thing to occur. And here we are, we're in the amazing waters of the land of the world of naval action. I'm in the shallows and let's see if I can get my brig going. I'm deploying sails and here we go. That's my first actual movement. The front sails, only the front sails are deployed and I'm getting wind, as you can see on the side where the compass is, I'm getting wind that is basically blowing to my, from to my port, this is uh, the right side, the left side of the shift is called port. And so let's see if I can do anything else. Okay, my fleet is in fleet information is here. Let's see if I can turn and I'm turning. That's pretty cool as well. The ship is pretty responsive. Right now, let's see if I can deploy uh -huh. <laughs> no, that's not <laughs> that's not what I plan to do actually. Let's redeploy those sails. And they there are. Again, very nice realism, very nice graphics, very impressive for a free to play game. And for starts, yeah, let's see if I can reach a ship over there and what happens when I do again the complexities that make up the game are a lot lot more impressive and expansive than the thing I'm showing you right now but even this is the result of the tutorials that I watched just minutes ago and which showcase how to get started in naval action and of course that is the naval gaming guide again the link to the same page to the same collection of tutorials in the is in the description below i'm slowly advancing across the seas there is my quote-unquote target not actually a target but a ship and i'm going to try to sail towards it and now i'm also going to set what is called an intercept course. So as far as I can see, it's sailing to the side, to my left side. So I'm going to try to kind of get close to it and see what happens, which is more, <laughs> more than I could say that I could showcase in this uh, guide, guide to a beginner guide, let's call it like that. 
here. Again, I'm really enjoying the visuals. The clouds are reminiscent of like classical paintings. So that's pretty cool. And the whole movement of the ship in the waters is really, really stable, really nice, really organic. So the game looks and feels really cool. Okay, the ship is turning quite rapidly. Let's see if I can follow it. And it's a lot faster than my brig. And I think it's leaving. I'm not deploying my main sails, so the other ship is a lot faster naturally. But still, I'm making headway here. And that's thanks to my front sail, as you can see, which I'm taking down now and I'm now <laughs> dead in the water. But with the deployment of sails, I can continue with my journey onwards or forwards. So there you have it. Now another sail is deployed. Okay, nice. This was a guide to a guide for anyone who is into naval action or wants to get into naval action. To do the same, please check out the link in the description below. It will take you to Naval Gaming, a page where you can reach and access Naval Action Beginner Quick Start Guide. All of the info, all of the tutorials, all of the video tutorials are right there and you can check them out and do a lot better than myself even though I did my best to sail here and now I'm making pretty good actual speeds here not sure how many knots ah, 40 knots nice and not bad so check out naval gaming and get into the world of naval action in a quick easy and effective manner to enjoy the gaming in the age of sales that's it for this video thank you so much for watching thank you so much for being here if you're a first time viewer please consider subscribing as I try to ram this ship and <laughs> have loads of fun. Ah, oh, we'll just sail past each other. Okay, have loads of fun in your naval action adventure. Again, my name is Ivica. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Consider subscribing and I'll see you on my new video. Until then, bye-bye.